Stunner Man Bird, Stunner Man, Man Bird, Man. Man Bird, Man. Young London, Young London, Rich Gang, Young for Rich life, gang. for Rich life, gang. for life. How long I've been doing it, how many different eras we've been seeing the change in the music and all this shit, right? So when I watch Young and Work London, it's got a different vibe. Honestly, my take on it, to me, right now, I think he's the best producer in the business as we speak today. That's putting it down. I'm gonna let his work ethics and his work and his music and the hits speaks for itself. I've been on the turf for a long time and we've been, we've been doing hits on the record. That's what we do over here, is hits. And, um, lifestyle to hit. You got a few hits out there, but it's just the beginning. You're gonna see a lot of body at work from Young Boy. And that's on my face. Where she came from. Thank God. I fought with a lot of producers, but I can honestly say ain't nobody better than a nigga. Nigga ain't nothing to play with. Yeah. If I could, I'd sign him for a hundred years. If I could. If I couldn't sign him for one year, it'd be the same thing. That's my nigga. Fuck with him alone. As I go up through there, I'm taking him. No question. Well, ain't no downfall. We ain't gonna have no downfall on that, cause we listen. Whatever the nigga tell me, I listen. Whatever I tell him, you gotta, he gotta listen. You did. Whatever I tell Bird, he listen. Whatever he tell me, I got to listen. It's just, why wouldn't you listen to a nigga with 500 million? No matter what nobody's saying, why wouldn't you listen to him? Why wouldn't you take heed of everything he tell you to take heed of? Everything he say, nigga, I don't give a fuck if he say he bought some 10 pound shoes yesterday, nigga, gotta listen to him. In London, I understand that. That's why everything, everything I say, that nigga pay attention to. Because he looking like we kind of have the same struggle. And I, and I went and got some money. Why wouldn't you listen to me? There's too much money involved to be telling him to do anything like, stupid, first of all. So he got it, can't do nothing but listen. You, want to, you can't tell him nothing but right. Everything ain't right around you. Everything ain't right around me. I ain't number some money. I can't, even, I can't tell him to do nothing wrong if I want to. If I tell him to kill him, nigga, I'm telling him, nigga, I got a million on him, kill him. You dig? I'm gonna tell him that stupid and dumb would have hurt, because it's gonna end up hurting me, because I'm gonna have to pay for it. You dig? But yeah, man, it's my producer. That nigga landed on the motherfucking train and nothing to play with. That nigga produced hookah, stone, not stone, hookah, lifestyle, all about the money. Man, tons of shit with me and Corn and Bird. Man, we finna, that nigga, man, that nigga finna go through that. This motherfucking video, he finna be in the making, that's why I gotta talk. This shit here in the making, boy. This shit is history. That young nigga gonna be real history. He gonna be history. He gonna be, I think he gonna be the best producer ever. You think that nigga gonna be the best producer? Bird. I say he the best producer in the game right now. The best as we speak. And he 21 years old. I'm gonna let his work speak for him. Y'all hear us saying that shit, but when we bang out and these numbers be popping off, y'all gonna understand why we saying that. We in this bitch every day, all day. Getting it in, putting it down. So, we just loading up. And we shoot these motherfucking choppers, it's coming. Ain't gonna never stop shooting. I do this shit for real. You hear me? We own one. We own one. We own one, but we damn sure one way, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, this is the life you dig, you know what I'm saying? We got London on the train. Place. I'm a rich nigga, got your nail on my waist. Damn. Run up on me playing, I'ma aim it at your face.
face. Can't go for anybody. Anyway, anyway. Hey, I'm a rich blood.